a match for two. Uh, hmm? Oh. You might need to move closer. Either that or move my mic closer to you, dude. Yeah. Um, so I just accidentally jumped ahead a little bit, but um, we might put it in. Mm -hmm. Someone talking about their sex life and stuff, but that's not my <laughs> that's not my issue. So I walked down, there was a warris. And uh, he gave me this, so yeah, didn't miss out on much. No, not much. So, uh, how much of Pokemon Go have you been playing? Me? Yeah. Mm, not a lot. Not a lot as recent. The first few days I played a bit, um, and then I got sort of stuck doing things. I also have just sort of gotten over a, a really bad flu, so oh. I've just been sleeping more than anything. Hmm. Yeah, well, that's it's that time of year where you just like have to just rug up and crap. I don't know. This winter, I. It might not be winter in um, some countries, obviously. It's summer in most, because I'm pretty sure the Northern Hemisphere has more land mass than the Southern Hemisphere, and the Southern Hemisphere has more water mass. I wouldn't yeah, disagree that against right. that. I wouldn't disagree against that. I'm pretty sure that's the correct. Mm -hmm. um, so, obviously, it would work like more... Um, oh, well, I'm dead. Nope. Um, more... Um, Out. Yeah. Uh, isn't there something to do as a war set here? I can't remember. No clue. I'm sort of talking to myself at the moment because <laughs> I know you have no idea. I'm just like, mm. I'm watching and I'm understanding. So if I ever wanted to play, I understand what I'm going to Yeah, I see, I do. play first games rather than sequels. Mm. I deserve that. <laughs> I deserve that. Clearly deserve it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're, 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 you're not you're, you're not quite over that cold, are you? No, uh, just a cough. Oh, that's all. I mean, yeah. I could drink something, but that's I'll do the that afterwards. Saying, Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that fucking hurt. Hmm. Yeah. Do you I, do you feel like this winter has been colder than like the last couple of years? Oh yeah. Mm. I think that's our coldest winter we've had in a long time, actually. Mm. I'm actually happy that I'm not in like in a very very old house where like the heating is absolutely crap or bad insulation for mm. once. Because I'll be There's absolutely one thing frozen. that really um, I keep getting distracted by something. Um, it's hard. It's different playing a game that's not so broken. It's so polished. There's, there's not a lot of you can pick about pick on about the game. So mostly when you're playing a game that's not broken, you can only talk about the gameplay rather than the game not play. Yeah. Or that, start, or, or you know, you actually going about, you know, what needs to be, what could be improved with the game. When, I'm not, not saying that Banjo Kazooie is a perfect game here, or there, but it's. I, 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 I give it a strong eight. An eight. I can't remember what it got as a um. As a um, rating back in the day. Hmm. I think it actually got a really fucking high rating to be I'd honest. I'd say with eight, you. nine. It was, it was universally loved by everyone. Even I know that, and I'm a PlayStation guy. If I uh, search my brain for a second here, I might be able to find the Metacritic score. Um, and I'm thinking about it, and I'm thinking about it really, really hard here. Thinking it really hard, and I got a Metacritic score of 92. Mm. Uh, that just sort of came to me right then and there. I didn't need any help in doing that. It sort of just Jared, popped into my head. your amazing brain astounds me every Metacritic time. psychic here. <laughs> oh, fuck. You let the Wikipedia... <laughs> Oh, Goodbye. The, Wiki the Wikipedia. Good ah! I fucking happened again. <laughs> <laughs> so it is a. Uh, I'm just. Oh, I've got something else coming to my head right now. Um, it was cute, funny, and continuously enchanting. It's what's good about gaming. It's like you're a whole. It's what's person good gaming is all about. about. Uh, talk when when you're in that Metacritic view. What can I say? I'm uh, I'm very astute when it comes to. You're uh, like the wiki of video games. I wish. Imagine if there was like a walking encyclopedia, or like a person was a walking encyclopedia for every single game. I mean, the closest I can think of that would be, I guess, um, oh god. There's a place like that called the 90s, it was called, uh, No! Central. I disagree! I've just had something pop up and be shoved in my face. Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts got a Metacritic score of 79. How the fuck did that- so someone, someone got bribed. Someone got bribed with that shit. That should be, uh, 
That should be a that should be a hard zero. That game shouldn't exist. It's like the fourth Indiana Jones movie. So I refuse to re <laughs> uh, acknowledge his existence. Mm. <sighs> that makes me angry. Oh wow, you're uh, offline. Ah, uh, whatever. We'll turn it, keep it offline. Someone's internet shit. Quite. God, I fucking. Stop showing Ooh. Metacritic critic scores, brain. It doesn't wow. deserve a 65. Indiana Jones in the Crystal Sky got a 65. It does not deserve that. Yeah, that's because uh, Spielberg fucking bribed everyone. Spielberg? Did Spielberg make it? Spielberg and, <clears throat> um... Uh, no, Spielberg and, um... Oh, what's the other guy? I, be f I would not be surprised if it's, um... I wouldn't be surprised if it's fucking, um, what's his name that ruins movies, Michael Bay. Nah, it was... Nah, by the looks of it, it was just Steven Spielberg as a director. Fucking look at that ugly mug. Oof. Ugh. Jesus, look at them glasses, man. Just... So, is there any more technology that's coming out? I really haven't had a look. Need you, technology? you seem to keep yourself sort of up and about, like... I kind of have <clears> to at <throat> work. Um... Anything really popping out? Um, like and the new Xboxes and all that sort of stuff that was announced at E3. I don't think we really talk much about those. Do you know anything about them? Um, uh, you're talking about the Slim or you're talking about the Scorpio? Okay, explain both to me. What's the difference between both of them? Um, from what I gathered, the, there's a new Xbox coming out. Um, a holiday this year. Um, so just before Christmas and that. It's a Slim Xbox. It's going to have a 2 terabyte. Um, hard drive. I'm pretty sure it's an SSD, just like they did with the Elite version. Um, oh, so the Elite had an SSD, but it's only one terabyte, right? Yes, yeah. yeah <clears> I actually <throat> picked that up, and I'm uh, loving it to death. Um, and plus you got, like, the awesome controller and that. Mm -hmm. um, with the Slim, there's no power brick. It is 40% more smaller, because, you know, technology and that. Um, yeah, well, the power brick's always, it's sort of been an obsolete type of thing. The PlayStation never really had the power brick. I know why the Xbox had it was because, you know, just in case of power failures. But in this day and age, we really don't need it. No, we have the technology, especially with, like, surge protection. Oh, that's what that. I was about to say. Surge protection boards. If you don't have a proper, like, a, even, a, like, a cheap surge protection board, you, 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 you're doing something wrong. Mm. They're not that expensive anymore, so... Now, plus you can get really good <clears> ones. Like, if you... Like, I... When I go for surge protectors for, like, my... My electronics and that, I need to go Vulcan. Only because if something was to... Screw up with the surge protector board... Uh, the surge protector board <clears> and <throat> all the... All the appliances that you have connected to it... Is covered under insurance and the lifetime warranty. Oh, actually by the company itself? Yep. Oh, that's clever. How much do those cost? Um, when I got mine, I think I got mine for... They retail like 100 to 120 for like a 4 or 5, I mean, that's five not, board. That's not too bad. Um, but I got mine because I um, I actually got mine pretty cheap. I think I got mine for 80 bucks because <coughs> I knew the guy working there. But they are <coughs> worth it in the long run. Excuse me. Um, it, like Belkin for most of their products have a lifetime warranty. If, if like what, their HDMI cables for like their high grade ones for the like 3D TVs, um, 4K TVs, uh, Blu-ray players and that. It works all good. How <laughs> funny. But yeah, no, I actually, um... But, but that's mostly for their TV items. They're, like, stuff for, like, mm, co um, cords. Um, like, your micro USB cords and that used for charging. They don't really have that for that. Okay. If not, they'd probably be losing a lot of money. <laughs> oh. I can't... I'm trying to remember so hard right now how to unlock this, um, desert area. Mm -hmm. um, can you just... This guy can bring up a Metacritic score in a second, but when it comes to his Game Boy 3s, he's dumb as a bat. <laughs> that, is, that is not even worth the dumb saying. As a, dumb as a bat. Dumb as a... I'm gonna say, I oh. thought bats were actually pretty intelligent. They are, they creatures. are. I just... I just... I just <laughs> done goofed. <laughs> done goofed. That's Matt. Um... Dun 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 You sure you don't need a dog? Jeez. Oh, what? I'm just dying. Don't worry about me. <laughs> there's a, there's an episode the title. The Jared's and, dying. And for the sake of the person that's already dead, yes, I can do it quietly. <laughs> it's just, oh. Jared, before you die, can I take your game consoles? 
you want, but <laughs> I'm sure you'd have to fight someone else over them. Uh, f two people, probably like your sister and that too. Oh, hello. I didn't even know that one was there. Where is this one? Oh, it's over there. You know, I'm not a smart person. I'm sure that was supposed to be like the third level. <laughs> <laughs> you think we skipped the level? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's see your master systems. This uh, this episode full of coughs. I think I'd be close to the end. Maybe my Man. my my Metacritic brain score is sort of telling me not to think about it, and it's close, but it's not so close, and uh, things like that. So I'm just choking on my spit at the moment. It's like we have a you know a spiritual director. There it is. Hello. Hello, Darius. Hello. Arrive. Arrive. All right. And as I enter this episode, uh, um, enter this area, we'd like to wrap. We might as well wrap <coughs> it up. I am like literally choking on my own phlegm. Thanks right. for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Yep. And um, tell us about what type of consoles you love the most. The most, the most, go on Sean Connery there. Oh. It's perfectly acceptable to backhand a woman when she backchats you. Oh, yes. It's perfectly acceptable to just give her a nice little slap. It's perfectly slap her or Bye. slap that ass. <sighs> Sexist enough for you? Uh. <coughs> 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 <coughs>